Okay. Ten days ago I was in Pakistan, in Karachi and Islamabad. Big demonstrations going on both places. And, uh, enormous anger spread throughout the people over the drones. And how it is that the United States of America feels it has a right to send these destructive weapons onto their soil, invading their sovereignty and killing their people indiscriminately, basically. And no matter how many you get, just get them. Pakistan's been a, a vital friend of ours for a long time. My history goes back to first President Bhutto through the two terms of his daughter. And we're losing it fast because you simply can't treat people like that and have their respect and their love. And the drones are singularly cruel because they come out of nowhere, they strike anywhere, they leave fear, which creates hatred everywhere. And the United States of America needs to stop the drones completely and destroy the technology dismantle our nuclear forces and try and live in peace with the rest of the world. We'll do it. I spent two days in Hanoi, uh, four years after going there during the bombing of the Dikes in August of 1972. It's amazing to see the capacity of the people to recover, love each other, to rebuild, to have happy families, and and prosperity in northern Vietnam. Uh, but uh, we're the Grim Reaper. Our military uh, is a threat to life on the planet. And America wasn't invented for that. We have to stop it. We have to stop it here. We have to stop it in this courthouse. The people who stand up uh, with their liberty on the line are the true American patriots. We need more of them. And we believe have to believe above all that we can do it. We're not helpless. It's simply a matter of will. And it's up to the American people now. Hey, any questions? Hey, hey. Thank, you. Thank you. Do you have any reason to believe, <laughs> sir, that your testimony will be allowed into the record for this particular trial? The question is whether I have any reason to believe my testimony. I have great reason to believe it will be because of the law. <laughs> The, the law authorizes it, but uh, whether it will be or not is a question of fact that I don't know the answer to. I understand the judge has taken a dim view of it. It's a little hard to understand. Uh, I've testified in, I think, all the other drone trials so far, the one in, in uh, Nevada and the one up in Syracuse, New York. And, uh, I don't know if my testimony will be any different this time, so it's something I'm supposed to know a little bit about. You'd like to be able to tell what to do, you know, so the court can decide fairly on the facts.